Buhari to now finally relocate to the Nigeria Republic. You know, this has been his her desire all this while before the military junta took over the affairs of the country. And that's why you see that uh, Buhari is talked in Nigeria. Now that uh, the wife of uh, Bazums and uh, the son has been released by the Niger Republic Junta, you know, uh, Buhari is planning to relocate finally. I think it will be easier for him to relocate. I think the man, uh, after, maybe after releasing the man, he will do that. But that is his plan, to relocate back to Niger Republic. At least they have been clearing the ground for him. Meanwhile, the Nigerian government reacts as Niger Republic Junta releases Bazoum's wife and son. Nigeria's Minister of Foreign Affairs, Amba Yusuf Tuga, has commended the release of Niger Republic former president. Okay, former president. It's not former. Mohammed Bazoum's wife and son from house arrest by the National Council for the Safeguard of the Homeland, the ruling military junta in the country. A statement issued on Tuesday by the minister's media aide, Akasim Abdukada, indicated that Tuga, who is also the chairperson of the Mediation and Security Council, said it is a logical step in bringing normalcy back to the country and the region in general. The minister called on the junta led by the General Abdurrahman Chiani to hasten the release of Mohammed Bazoum from custody and allow him to fly to a third country as a step towards further talks on lifting sanctions. He also urged the junta to initiate the transition to constitutional rule in the interest of peace and stability in Niger. As well as the entire region, Bazoum and some members of his family had been under military custody since the July coup that ousted him from power. Okay. <laughs> mm. So the federal government is still having the boldness to talk on how to go about this whole thing. That the man should be allowed to go to a third country so that they will continue the negotiations and all of that. You think that is going to be possible? Well, I know that a, a lot of the talks are ongoing as per the release of this man. But I know that Tinubu, uh, Buhari cannot wait. Buhari cannot wait to go back to Nigeria Republic. I think uh, the luck uh, Buhari is having is that he had already warned the politicians and those who are taking over from him not to disturb him with anything. If there's anybody that they feel that uh, has dipped his or her hand inside the cookie jar or has, you know, have any corruption levied against him or her, especially those that worked under him, that they should not even bother involving him. They should not involve him at all. I think uh, that is uh, the enjoyment that he's having right now. You see that the all this uh, Mefele, this uh, Mefele, that Tinubu's people, uh, Buhari people have not said anything concerning that. Uh, the only thing that would have made no, if nobody to hear about Buhari is if, if 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 the road, the road, everything on the road is cleared. But I think uh, the road is beginning to be cleared for him so that he can go back to Niger. Honestly speaking, Buhari has really invested in Niger so much nobody's even talking about it okay well because of the military junta that has taken over the country because the nigeria investments in that country that was done under that was done under buhari nobody saying anything because uh, the junta military junta they have taken over is that a waste maybe by the time the former president is being released from the coffer of the Niger Junta, the Nigerian government will start making money because they spent money and Buhari himself, his own personal business that he established there. Because like they always say, man proposes, God disposes. Those were the things that they were planning. But unfortunately, it's boomeranged against, uh, against them.
It is there. Mm. Oh, wow. Wonders they say shall never end. For how long are we going to continue like this? Somebody say, do if, if you are culpable of any offense, you say, oh, they should not come after you. Nobody should disturb you. And that is it. It's like there's a kind of conspiracy. But once you have served as a president in Nigeria, in this our Nigeria, nobody dares. Even the so-called... Uh, the ruling, uh, the the president, governor, uh, president, will not even do anything. It's like a unwritten agreement. It's unfortunate. As far as Nigeria is concerned, no matter the offense, the 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 best thing they can do is to go after those who worked under such people. Many people are told Tinubu to call to uh, to. Call to do a uh, boy for investigation. Did you listen? No, no, no. Hmm. It was just like hey, this guy, he's uh, just a wishful thinking. It's not going to happen. It's not going to happen at all, at all, at all. So, guys, let's know what you think and have your take on this. Thank you.